Nathan Hale was a Patriot spy. His mission? Getting secret information out of New York to General George Washington. But the British caught him. And for spies in the Revolutionary War, there were no second chances. He was hanged on a September morning in 1776, at the tender age of 21. With Hale dead, Washington had to find another way of getting information out of New York City. Luckily, his new spy chief, Benjamin Talmadge, had grown up near New York City, in Setauket, Long Island, and knew the lay of the land. He recruited locals with no connection to the army, like his old friend, Abraham Woodhull. Woodhull regularly visited the city, staying at his brother-in-law's boarding house, where it was easy to make conversation with the British officers who lodged there. His reports on things like shipping and troop movements were delivered to Tallmatch. Even if a British soldier intercepted a report, he wouldn't have understood it. Tallmadge had devised a sophisticated code system. Woodhull signed his letters using his alias, Culper, and nobody outside the small spy ring knew who he really was. The reports used a series of numbers to stand in for key words. New York, for instance, was 727, and George Washington was 711. The system worked well, but it wasn't foolproof. Someone gave the British a tip-off about Woodhull. Soldiers went to his home at Setauket and seriously beat his father. Luckily for Woodhull, a prominent local officer vouched for him. After that, Woodhull knew he couldn't risk many more trips to the city. He recruited another agent, who was given the codename Culper Jr. And his cover was so good, it took more than a century for historians to discover that his real name was Robert Townsend, a merchant well-respected in loyalist circles. Townsend's reports, often written in invisible ink, were passed on to a network of couriers who deposited them in a secret spot on Long Island. Woodhull would pick them up later, ensuring that anyone following a courier wouldn't know who they were delivering to. The Culper Ring has generated a lot of speculation over the years. But what's certain is that the network was a major success, exposing a number of British plots, like Benedict Arnold's plan to turn West Point over to the Redcoats. And Tallmadge's talent for secrecy meant that none of his agents met the same horrible fate as Nathan Hale. 